Hello everyone and welcome to this video. Today, we're going to talk about 10 Christian martyrs who died because of their faith. These people are shining examples of courage and faithfulness in the face of persecution. Our first story is about Stephen, who was one of the first deacons in the early Christian church. Stephen was arrested and brought before the Sanhedrin on charges of blasphemy. Despite the false accusations, Stephen remained faithful to Jesus and was stoned to death. The second story is about Polycarp, who was the bishop of Smyrna. He was arrested and ordered to renounce his faith, but he refused to do so. Instead, he declared, 86 years have I served him, and he has never done me wrong. How then can I blaspheme my king who saved me? Polycarp was burned alive for his refusal to deny Jesus. Our third story is about William Tyndall, who was an English scholar and Bible translator. He was burned at the stake for translating the Bible into English, which was considered heresy at the time. Tyndall's work helped make the Bible accessible to ordinary people, and his sacrifice paved the way for future translations. The fourth story is about Jan Hus, who was a Czech priest and reformer. Hus was burned at the stake for advocating for the reform of the Catholic Church. His ideas helped lay the groundwork for the Protestant Reformation, and his martyrdom inspired many other reformers. Our fifth story is about Dietrich Bonhoeffer, who was a German pastor and theologian. Bonhoeffer was executed by the Nazi regime for his opposition to Hitler and his defense of the Jewish people. His writings on Christian ethics and discipleship continue to inspire people around the world today. The sixth story is about Jim Elliot, who was a missionary to the Warani people of Ecuador. Elliot and four other missionaries were killed by members of the tribe they were trying to reach. Despite the tragedy, Elliot's widow and others continued the work and many Warani people became Christians. Our seventh story is about Perpetua and Felicity, who were early Christian martyrs in North Africa. Perpetua was a noblewoman who was arrested for her faith, and Felicity was her slave who chose to stay with her. They were both thrown to wild animals in the arena and finally killed by a sword. Their courage and devotion to each other and to Jesus continue to inspire people today. The eighth story is about the Korean martyrs, a group of Christians who were martyred for their faith during the Joseon dynasty in Korea. The martyrs included men, women, and children from all walks of life, who refused to renounce their faith even in the face of torture and death. Today, their witness continues to inspire Christians in Korea and around the world. The ninth story is about the Ugandan martyrs, a group of Christians who were martyred for their faith in Uganda. They included both Catholic and Anglican converts, who were executed for refusing to renounce their faith. Their courage and faithfulness have had a lasting impact on the Christian church in Uganda and beyond.